All right, guys, so today we're going to be talking about stem changing verbs again. So all the previous lessons and activities have been for E to IE stem changing verbs. And today we're going to be moving on to O to UE stem changing verbs. So before we get into that, let's just remind ourselves about the rules with stem changing verbs. Stem changing verbs have regular AR, ER, and IR present tense endings. So that means that the endings are going to be the same as they always are. For AR verbs, that's going to be O, AS, A, AMOS, AN. For ER, that's going to be O, S, E, EMOS, EN. And for IR, that's going to be O, S, E, EMOS, EN. So for stem changing verbs, the stem is going to change in all forms except for nosotros and vosotros. And then over here we have an example of an E to IE stem changer. So we can see here the E changes to IE, which is what we talked about in our last lessons. But like I said, this lesson is all about O to UE stem changing verbs. These are some of the most common O to U E stem changing verbs. So we have almorzar, which means to eat lunch. Encontrar, which means to find. Dormir, which means to sleep. Costar, which means to cost. Poder, which means to be able to, or in other words, can. And volver, which means to return or to come back. So let's take two of these verbs and break them down and talk about how we change the stem of a verb. So before we can change the stem, we need to know what the stem is. Okay, so when we're conjugating stem changing verbs, really conjugating any verb, the first step is always to take off the ending. So in this case, we're going to take off er. So again, ER is the ending of our verb. So we're going to take it off and we're left with this, this part of the word pod or pod in Spanish. That is called our stem. Regular verbs, you would just add on your new endings. O, S, A, A, M, O, S, N. But these are stem changing verbs. That means a change is going to happen in the stem. And because we know that poder is an O to U, E stem changing verb, we know that the change is going to happen to the O. So this O is going to become UE. So our new stem is PUED. And then we would add our new endings. O, S, A, EMOS, ACE, and N. So remember that stem changing verbs are sometimes also referred to as boot verbs or shoe verbs. Because if we were to draw a figure around the forms that do stem change, which is everything except for nosotros and vosotros, it would look similar to a boot. Okay? So let's just look at those forms first. So my yo form is going to be puedo, I can, or I am able to. Tú puedes. Usted el ella puede. Ustedes, ellos, ellas, pueden. So we can see here that all of these forms changed from an O to a UE in each of these forms. Now what about these two forms that are left outside of the boot, our nosotros and vosotros? Those are not going to have a stem change. So we're actually going to retain P-O-D, pod. So nosotros is going to be podemos, and vosotros is going to be podes. All right, let's look at the verb dormir. So what's our first step when conjugating? Our first step is going to be to take off I-R, because that is our ending. So you always remove your ending first. We're left with dorm, which is our stem. 
Again, we know that dormir is an O to UE stem changing verb. So we know that this O in dorm is going to become a UE, giving us our new stem, duerm. Now, dormir is an IR verb, so the endings that we're going to add are going to be O, S, E, Emos, Is, and N. So again, if we draw our figure, we know that everything inside of this figure is going to stem change. So yo is not going to be dormo. We're going to change that o to a ue. It's going to be duermo. Tu duermes. Usted el ella duerme. Ustedes ellos ellas duermen. And then again, nosotros and vosotros are outside of the figure. So they are not going to stem change. They're going to keep that O. So nosotros is going to be dormimos. And vosotros is going to be dormis. All right, let's do some practice. So number one, los chicos blank a casa a las siete de la noche. Volver, meaning to return or to come back. We know it's an O to UE, stem changing verb. So we know that this O is going to become a UE in our new form. So it would be vuelven. It ends in an EN because los chicos is plural. They would fall under the ellos category. So our ending would be in vuelven. The boys return to their house at 7 at night. Number two, la entrada, which means ticket, blank 20 euros. And our verb is costar. La entrada cuesta 20 euros. The ticket cost 20 euros. Number three, nosotros blank en la cafeteria. Remember that almorzar means to eat lunch. It is going to be almorzamos. We do not stem change here because remember, we do not stem change for nosotros or vosotros. And since our subject is nosotros, we're going to keep that O. Number four, Susana blank hablar bien el español. And our verb is poder, to be able to, or can. Puede. Susana puede hablar bien el español. Susana can talk or speak Spanish well. Number five. Yo blank en la noche. Dormir. Dormir means to sleep. So what is going to be the form of dormir for number five? Duermo. I sleep at night. So as you can see here, all of these answers, except for number three, changed from an O to a UE. And the reason why we did not change in number three is because we do not stem change for nosotros. Okay, last set of practice. We have a paragraph here. Los domingos por la tarde, yo blank... In la restaurante Casa Serrano con mi familia. I remember again that almorzar means to eat lunch. So on Sunday afternoons, I eat lunch in the Casa Serrano restaurant with my family. Almuerzo. Very good. So remember the O becomes a UE. Number two. Nosotros blank platos muy buenos en el menú. Remember that encontrar means to find. Encontramos. Very good. We're not going to stem change. We're going to keep the O because our subject is nosotros and we do not stem change for nosotros. Number three. Y la comida no blank mucho. Costar means to cost. So the food does not cost a lot. Cuesta. Number four, yo nunca blank comer todo porque sirvan mucho comida. I can never eat all of it because they serve a lot of food. 
our form of poder here is going to be puedo. Number five, nosotros blank a casa a las tres o a las cuatro. So what is the form of volver going to be? Volvemos. Again, we do not stem change because we never stem change for nosotros, so we're going to keep that O. We return to our house at three or four. Muchas veces mis hermanos menores están cansados y blank dos horas. Our subject here is mis hermanos. So what are we going to change dormir to? Duermen. Very good. So mis hermanos is plural. That would fall under ellos. So our ending would be in. Often my younger siblings are tired and they sleep two hours. Okay. Very good. Remember that with stem changing verbs, yet again, we never stem change in nosotros or vosotros. Feel free to watch this video again if you need more practice. Adios chicos. Goodbye.